The scientific name for the timber rattlesnake is Cretalis horridus. It's a venomous pit viper from the eastern United States. Timber rattlesnakes really enjoy a woodland environment. They uh, love leaf litter and, and logs. They uh, use the leaf litter kind of as a camouflage to hide from predators and to ambush their prey. They enjoy the food of rodents, so they eat uh, mostly chipmunks and mice and squirrels. Timber rattlesnakes are ambush predators, which means they wait in hiding for their prey to come. It's a much more safe and effective way to eat. Once the prey is already dead, they will track it using their scent and go find its body and consume that. The timber rattlesnake's venom is a potent venom. It has a lot of hebotoxin in it, which uh, breaks down the red blood cells. For the most part, they're a very docile animal, so bites are, are very uncommon. A lot of times, even with humans, they'll do what they call dry bite, where they actually don't release any venom, or they might even strike you with their mouth closed. So timber rattlesnakes are not as dangerous to humans as other animals because they will warn us before they bite us. They have the rattle that they will tell us, hey, get away, we're going to bite, we feel threatened. They are endangered largely because of habitat loss and fragmentation. This causes small populations to form where they can't cross from one population to another to find mates. This becomes a problem when snakes cross into development areas and encounter humans. Humans will often kill the timber rattlesnakes out of fear. Timber rattlesnakes are a key predator in the ecosystem. First of all, they, they help with rodent populations. Rodents, you know, carry lots of diseases and things that we don't really want. Rodents carry ticks. They actually can eat 2,500 to 4,500 ticks uh, a year per individual snake. You can help prevent extinction by protecting their habernaculas. Don't break them up, don't destroy them. Also keeping a buffer zone around your house of about 10 yards, um, a clean area where they won't really want to come. If you happen to encounter a timber rattlesnake in the wild, the best thing you can do is to give it space and leave it alone. They will respect you as long as you respect them.